Is it possible to make a cinematic GoPro video at home? Today we will find out all together. Hey, how are you doing? I hope you are not too bored at home. I'm as well stuck as many of you guys, so I thought today's the day where we could try out the challenge if it's possible to make a cinematic video being only at home. The rules for this challenge are really simple. The video has to be made from at home. I can't leave the house and the video has to be between 15 and 30 seconds long. That's perfect for Instagram because I'm not only going to show you the final edit here on YouTube. I also upload it to Instagram where you can vote if I pass the challenge or not. If I get 51% or more upvotes, then I have passed. Otherwise I have failed and you decide. So the first thing which is really important is always the story and here I'm really limited so my story is only how I prepare my drone to fly it from here from this window to the city. That's the story. As I said, I'm really limited, so it's gonna be a very simple and short one. So let's directly continue with the shots I want. For the first one, I need to go inside again. I prepare my drone and I film it from many different angles, so I got a lot of different short shots. And then in the end, you will see why I decided to make a lot of different ones. So I decided to do these shots here outside because I didn't want to disturb the other two people who live here by me talking weird things in English to a camera. So I'm gonna continue the things here. So the first shots are just gonna be handheld shots in 4K and 30 frames per second with a wide field of view. So now I need to improvise a little bit. I'm just gonna use this one as a mouth mount as I need both hands to unpack the drone and I'm just gonna choose the same angle for the first few steps and then towards the end I'm gonna change to a bottom level angle again. So before I'm gonna show you the next shot, I would like to ask you if you're interested in seeing live streams. I think that would be a great idea to deliver as much content as possible. So I could do daily, ah, oh, this wind is so annoying. I could do daily live streams if you are interested and show you how I edit my videos or just answer random questions you guys have. So just let me know in the comments if you're interested and also hit the like button. The more likes this video has, then I know that you're really interested in those live streams. So let's move on. So right here I'm gonna place my GoPro, here the drone and from this angle I'm gonna shoot the rest of the shots. Okay, so that's it for the drone part, but I need my mobile phone and the controller. I'm gonna do the exact same again. Forgot it inside, need to go back. So I'm gonna switch back to the mouth mount because I need two hands to put my mobile phone into the controller. I'm gonna again do a lot of little short shots with different angles and then we are moving on to the next one. So now I need a shot where I hand start the drone from here. I'm just gonna place my GoPro somewhere behind here to film it. Look at this mount, you can use Crocs just for anything. Best shoes in the world. Alright, so now the last shot I need is just a drone shot I just made. You're gonna see it in the final edit and don't forget after you have seen this video to go to my Instagram profile to vote if I have passed the challenge or not. So watch the final edit and then we are gonna see each other again for my last words for this video. All right, guys, so that was my cinematic edit. I hope you liked it and remember you can go to my Instagram to vote if I have passed the challenge or not. Just click on the YouTube challenges highlights and there you will find the previous challenge. I have made this one and also the future ones. And yeah, 
that's it stay at home i know it's gonna be boring but i try to upload as much content as possible for you guys so again let me know if you would like to see those live streams and then who knows maybe we see each other in a live stream or otherwise in the next video adios